Today is November 8th and here's what's making news on Roadshow. Tesla's going from buying machines to buying companies that build machines. It made moves to acquire Germany-based Grumman Engineering in hopes that it will help improve Tesla's manufacturing process ahead of the Model 3 production. Tesla anticipates that it will hire an additional 1,000 engineers and technicians after the acquisition. The deal isn't final yet as it must pass regulatory muster in both the United States and in Germany. Workhorse currently builds electric delivery trucks, but it wants to get into the pickup game with its electric W15 pickup concept. It promises a lithium-ion battery pack good for 80 miles, with a gas-powered range extender providing extra juice as necessary. The company also promises autonomous emergency braking, which has yet to gain traction in the pickup market. It's a moonshot, sure, but it could help clean up fleet vehicles in a big way if it becomes a reality. By 2020, every Ferrari will have some sort of hybrid technology inside of it. That's the word from Ferrari CEO Sergio Marchione, who said that the company needs to embrace electrification if it hopes to sell more than 10,000 cars per year. Once an automaker hits that number, fuel economy and emissions targets become harder to hit, hence the pushing for higher voltage. Considering how good the La Ferrari is, that shouldn't be a problem for anybody. Find out more on these stories over on theroadshow.com, and we'll talk to you tomorrow.